So when you search, what is the best smartwatch for tracking health? You're most likely going to get the Apple Watch. I for sure did, and I'll prove it to you guys. You guys can tell right here that I did not put anything to do with Apple. Now, yeah, maybe it's because all I search is Apple, so it already gives me the Apple Watch, but you can also tell that there are other smartwatches from various amount of prices here as well. Now, I'm pointing this out because the Apple Watch has gained an enormous amount of customers because of the health features that it can track. And pretty soon it's going to get even more. If you think that Apple Watch has gained its peak, it really hasn't. Let's talk about the other feature that is coming to the Apple Watch. What's up guys, I'm Monty here, and in today's video, guys, like I said, Apple Watch is number one, and always will be in my book. So, from this article that I'm going to post in the description for you guys, it said that Apple is working on getting more health features. Now, as stated in this article, the Apple Watch at first was more of a fashion product. And of course, with a couple of health features. But over time, Apple has given us a lot of health features that have helped us every single day. And as I said in the beginning of the video, the number one watch that you see on the news and everything is the Apple Watch. That's the number one that I've seen at least. It doesn't stop there. The Apple Watch every year gets new features and new technologies to help track your health. And for this, I'm really, really proud and really, really happy because now it's gonna help diabetics. Man, you know, at this time, I really, really, wish Apple Watch existed years ago when my grandmother was still alive because it would have helped her so much. And it's gonna help so many diabetics with this feature. Talking about glucose monitoring. And again, you'll find more information about it here in this article. But, you know, that just helps a lot of diabetics and you don't necessarily have to take blood. Well, that's a good thing. I mean, I know a lot of diabetics who have to, you know, poke themselves with something and take their blood and do this and do that. And it, it gets hard. So having this feature is really going to help a lot of people, you know, and it honestly doesn't stop there. I mean, there are things out there that you and I may not think about right now, but Apple is always working on different things to help people track their health each and every day. And if you think that Apple Watch has reached its peak, it really, really hasn't. So, you know, I, I give props to Apple for, you know, inventing these new technologies to track health right on your wrist. It's really, really exciting to see all the new features that come each and every year on the new Apple Watches and even in software as well. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you guys are new. Let's have a conversation in the comment section down below. Which health feature would you like to see next coming to Apple Watch? How can it get better with, when it comes to tracking health? I want to hear your opinions down in the comments. Or if you guys want to have a deeper conversation, again, join my social media and even my Discord. I'm always on there almost every day. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter for 
the link to my Discord. I do post that every so often as well. Again, with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the very next video.